Hello, everybody. It's Crest. Do it. And we're back. And we're jumping to a new system. To fight. To win. To survive. But yeah, we're just going to play this again. Because I figured, why not? And plus, now that I've got the schedule up, these should be going out once a week. Although I'm not sure, because I'm recording this all in advance because I'm leaving to go to Israel while I'm recording this. When this goes up, though, I should already be in Israel. Alright, so this is mostly land-based. But we could control these water points, because those would be easy to control. So I think we're going to start from here. Alright, here comes my commander. Oh, uh, yeah. We haven't even done anything between planets yet. That stuff is cool. Like when you smash planets into other planets. Do all that fun stuff. Alright, so we've got all those up. And all those up. We're gonna pop down some fabbers. So these first few battles are gonna look pretty similar until we start getting new tech for vehicles at least you know it'll be the same kind of formation we'll have bombers um, and just vehicles it'll just be the same thing pretty much until we get nukes or titans then things get crazy because nukes those are so fun. They're a two-shot for any commander. But I like to only use one, so their entire base is destroyed, and then I can just send in a massive army. I just think that looks the most cinematic. Chances are, I think the commander's probably going to be around these nodes. Maybe these, if I had to guess. He won't be in this entire area, I can guarantee you that. But around here, there's a lot. So ideally what we're going to do is after we make all this stuff, we're going to head this way. Ooh, handy little side note, if you press N, that orients you north. So, yeah, from where we are, we're going to head north and east a bit. I'm just gonna set this as our view. Alright, as soon as this is ready, I'm gonna tell it to build five of these. And then those guys can start working on other things around the base, like we won't really need defense if we have a big enough army I mean, that's kind of stupid, but that's how the AI works in this game. Okay, so this guy, you are going to go here. This next guy is going to go along these nodes. And the third guy is going to go down here. Then the last two are just going to patrol around here. Bop, bop, bop. Actually, I guess last. Actually, no, last two. I was right when I said that. This guy's gonna go here. Boop, boop, boop. Wait, will he actually go through the water? Oh, that would be so funny. Nah, looks like he's not. Alright, so. Patrol this area. Yeah, that looks good. And actually, you know you're going to patrol still, too. This area. But you are going to have the job of that. And then once they're done building nodes, I'm going to get them on some base defense. Alright, so we've got this up. So now we can start building these anti-air. 
continuous build. We'll go with ants, continuous build. Mm, drifter, continuous build. So the same thing as before. What are you doing out there? You stupid. Alright, so he's going to have the job of base defense. We're going to make sure every single node is covered by at least one turret. Yeah, and then we're going to go with five of these guys, just so we have that. Air factory. We'll only go with five, because I think I'm going to have them just scouted out around here. And we'll also select all the vehicle units so that way they're all being sent there. Now we can go with all air units. Let's see what we can see. Yep, here come these. So not by those pockets of nodes. Not seeing them over here. This one? Yeah. There he is. So he doesn't really have much in the way of base defense. He's got some AA guns, but that's not really much. So I'm just going to let those guys perish because I mean like that. Yeah. Then we'll go with these. And then this guy, you are going to build us El Senor Radar right there. All right. So we've got some work going for us. What's nice is we don't even really need, um, what's it called? The thingies. The portals, because he's only right over here. So, it doesn't really matter, you know? This guy is going to go with the turret here. and here just so that way we've got even more defense actually no once he finishes that one I'm actually going to have him build the turret here like around here so stop pause collaborate and listen radar's ready yeah, see, look, now we can actually see that he has units around this entire place right there. And we don't need a portal. We could just come up and crush him. <laughs> but I do feel like that just in case if he manages to get all the way down to the water we should do this just have a bunch of these coming out they'll all help this guy just because I like having an orbital unit let's see what are you doing you're building the turrets and you are doing nothing so you will build this What? Oh, okay. That's because I selected that guy. Okay, I see. Alright, so we're gonna start moving our armies towards him. 
like all of our tanks, all of our planes should be set to go here. Like that, that, that. Did I already select this? Maybe, maybe not. Just in case I'm gonna hit it again. All right, now we can select all air units in view. Tell them all to go there. All land units in view. Tell them all to go there. And now, it's just a waiting game. My metal resources aren't looking good, but that's because I'm building a ton of these guys. Like, I mean, look how fast these guys build it. That's kind of crazy. So yeah, that's what happens when our efficiency goes down. Everything is slow. Commander, you are going to help this guy out. Hmm, how much do these cost? 600 metal. That's kind of painful. See, look, now it's churning out things slow as molasses. And actually, I think we have enough of these guys. So instead, we're going to have them make a bunch of these guys. As soon as he's done, I'm going to tell him to stop and then build that on a loop. This guy, we want him to do this. You know, just a quick little space probe. Just so we can see entirely what's going on. Like this. Vroom, vroom. What's nice is these are super expendable, so it doesn't matter. And they let us see things like this. Like right here, he's got just basic turret, anti-air gun, advanced turret, anti-air gun, and he's making currently anti-orbital, so this is going to be taken down pretty soon. Why are these guys not coming? Go this way. These guys are actually really good. So they're actually going to be leading our assault. So we're going to have them come over here. Just like that. We'll select all these deselect that that and that tell them all to go there these are just a precaution okay yeah he shot down my anti-orbital thing with this i think we could wait for a few more and then we should be good Yeah, let's go with three more um, flying units. So, not counting that one that just left. So that one's one. You're going to help them. That one's two. And last, but certainly not least, three. Alright, as soon as they get over, we're launching the attack. Select all ground units. Attack this one. Select all air units. Attack this one. This guy in particular. Did we kill him? Oh, we killed him. My ground army didn't even get in. What is this? S 
stop shooting. We've defeated you. Yay, we won. Alright. Continue war. Let's see what we got as a reward. Explore. Complete air tech. We definitely want this. Alrighty, everyone. That's going to do it for me today. Hope you have enjoyed. If you did, be sure to hit that like button down below. It means a lot. It lets me know that you actually like watching my stuff. And I guess without further ado, I will see you in the next one. Bye!